Did you want some clothes? Kate says, whose clothes are these? They're not mine. She gets into the house. These aren't mine. Just that moment of somebody else's clothes in the house. There's Sarah's clothes and she's having a baby. I think one of my favourite scenes is when Kate and James is sitting on the grass and she's like, it's okay, I'm back, I'm alive, the grass is green. I'm alive. And there's sun and there's sky and there's grass. I'm not sick. And I feel incredible. I just, I love that scene. It was it's really powerful. The scene where James meets Kate. You got me, Kate. I'm Kate Willis. Uh, that was a big emotional scene to do and a, and a really, really tricky one. How does one act in that moment? Who knows? I mean, you don't know until you're doing it. And I can only, I'm only pretending. What's happened? No. So it's a combination of your own emotional scraps and your imagination to sort of put that together. But I think it worked well. I had to give birth in season one and Patty and I were there and we're doing the, you know, the full like p pushing the baby out thing. And then they brought in this baby that was a few days old and it's covered in like jelly and um, lube and stuff. And they put it down on your chest and it's this tiny baby and it's sort of, you know, kind of stops crying and it's listening for your heartbeat and it was like oh my god it was insane it was the most insane beautiful moment and it, you don't you know we were both kind of like quite overwhelmed by it <laughs> at least she did this operation on vic and i had to kind of break his leg back into into place and i remember working with a surgeon on that to how to do that because i was like oh broken leg broken leg oh it's gonna hurt and, and the surgeon who was there was like no get in there and really wrangle that leg back together and i thought oh jesus that's it great day i remember wearing the scrubs and getting all the blood and it was really manky and great and there's this line that Maria says when we're um, all eating her meal that she's cooked for us. Um, she's like, we're, uh, perhaps we're back to make right wrongs. All of us need to put things right. What things? Our past, our mistakes. I didn't make any mistakes. Then why did you die so young? And it's this really poignant line, I think, for Kirsty. I really, really liked that moment. Where Kirsty calls me a poofta is funny. When we're bearing Vic. You're real, mate. And I love you. That's all I need. A poofta falling in love with me. No, I didn't say I was in love with you. Mm. <sighs> What's a poofta? <laughs> I think one of the first things that. that, that that my character said was, um, I mean, he, he's pretty silent. I think it could be the first line he says. Hi in hell. And you don't know whether he's going to hit her or he's going to be violent or he's going to run or what he's going to do. Um, and you sort of have a little understanding that even though um, <clears throat> he seems dangerous, there's a, there's a vulnerability there because he's, you know, he's as scared as everyone else.